Today we're going to show you how to properly plumb your water tank for a pressure washer setup. First thing you want to do is identify where you'll be installing the bulkhead fitting, which should be near the bottom of the tank. Our water tanks have three prefabricated spots where you can drill into to install the bulkhead fitting. In this video, we're going to be installing a 2 inch banjo bulkhead fitting into the water tank. We recommend using a minimum of an inch and a half bulkhead on an 8 gallon per minute setup to ensure you're getting enough water to your pump. Next you'll need an electric drill. We use a 3 and 1 8 inch hole saw drill bit for a 2 inch bulkhead fitting and that'll make a nice clean hole for our bulkhead fitting. I pre-marked our drill spot using a uh, permanent marker so we're just gonna flip uh, the tank up on its side here and uh, make sure everything is lined up as long as it looks good we decided to move it up about a quarter inch as you can see there just to make sure that the bulkhead fitting wouldn't be uh, in the way of uh, the ground or however it goes on you want to make sure you do a nice clean cut here this is important as you know once you make the hole there's no going back now that you have your hole drilled uh, what we're going to be doing is uh, feeding the fitting and gasket through the hole from the inside of the tank I'd like to mention right now that you'll need to rinse your tank out just to make sure you don't leave any plastic or debris inside of the water tank uh, whenever you get through with this project so now we're gonna go ahead and uh, flip this water tank back upright onto its legs and uh, this is when we are gonna use a broomstick or a heavy duty wire uh, and we're gonna use that to feed the inside part of the bulkhead fitting down to the hole you see we have a broomstick here you know nothing special about it and we're just using this to feed that down and uh, we're just gonna go ahead and slide that straight down to the hole uh, you want to make sure that the gasket is also on the inside of the hole should be the gasket and the male thread uh, on the inside there and you're gonna have the gasket staying on the inside and the male thread being fed through the hole that you just drilled out just like that and once you get that done uh, next you'll just have to tighten the bulkhead fitting which is a reverse thread and that will complete the uh, plumbing of your water tank uh, stay tuned and subscribe to Jane Equipment's YouTube video for more videos on how to properly attach your newly plumbed water tank to your pressure washer pump and as always feel free to visit jnequipment.com for all hardware used in this project and more information.